Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you my homeschooling curriculum for my grade 3 son. Um, we are based in Australia and our, our calendar year and our school year run from January, December. So in a couple of weeks time we are going to be starting year 3. Um, so I thought I'd go through all the resources we're going to be using this year, starting with maths and English. So this is targeting maths for year 3. We've come, we've followed all of the other targeting maths, book, maths books. I really enjoy it and it's got a CD, DVD, CD-ROM as well. Um, I really enjoy it. He loves it. This covers all of the curriculum for maths in Victoria which is the state that we live in in Australia and so it just makes it really easy. We work through that and it covers everything he needs to know. And the targeting English book, um, it's the first time I've tried these targeting English books. They also are, are similar to the targeting math. They look bright and colourful and fun and all kinds of activities. So I look forward to having a play with that one and seeing how he goes. The other literacy activity we're going to be doing is I've got him a diary for this year. He loves the Treehouse books. There's a whole series of Treehouse stories. And my plan is to get him to write in it every single day something that he has done because be honest he's not the most passionate about writing so I felt this would be a fun way to get him writing every single day even if it's just a sentence at least he'll be writing at least he can kind of use his imagination think about what he did the day what he wanted to do and it's just really fun as well so that's one of the activities we'll be doing through this school year a new hopefully a new tradition that we'll pick up that we will continue for years to come so that kind of covers basic literacy and numeracy um, we do also he he loves reading he might not be a huge writer but he loves reading so he's big on reading and maths happens all the, all the time in all different ways so I'm quite happy with these resources as a starting off point so I'll move these aside and we'll talk science he loves all things sciencey so I've got the year three and four science and technology that kind of covers the Australian curriculum and a science guide for primary students there's all units and I use these as springing off points so we'll look and we'll see something whatever interests him we go into a lot more detail and we almost do many projects about it about whatever about whatever he has learnt that interests him and along the similar line is problem solving I think the most important thing to teach children is problem solving skills so 14 units all about problem solving is just another workbook we kind of will dip into through the year depending on how we're going with other activities moving through this one really quickly aren't I um, and history we've got this history guide but we also um, I don't have resources for geography for geography I've gone through the curriculum and we're going to explore um, neighboring countries of Australia and also over the next couple of years explore countries in Africa and South America and we're going to be starting this year with an exploration of the Amazon that's kind of what we've centered on we've narrowed down on the Am on the Amazon and about the Amazon and we can watch some documentaries and we'll get some books out the library and we'll just explore and um, if you watch any of my other videos on this channel you'll know that we aim towards a minimalist way of life so I much prefer to get books out from the library save money save clutter in the house get library books watch documentaries if we must print things off from the internet that we find but I try not to buy a crazy amount of resources, just kind of the bare minimum, and I find the science, this history in the science book covers a lot of what we need to at least, at least the starting off points, <laughs> and they're cute as well. Um, so they cover all everything, the basics that we need to know, and then when there's something that, he, that interests him, as I said, we go and we learn more about it. So at least he knows the minimum, you can see the carnivals, see that's kind of all they learn about the carnival in Brazil, I want to know more about the history of it and teach them everything else that's just beyond the kind of black and white in the textbook. <sighs> as I said, I love homeschooling, <laughs> so the final resources that I have for him are these two books which I thought were a bit advanced but he's already started looking through them and he's really really interested in learning more about programming and coding so this kind of covers technology and graphic design and engineering that's really they're just very stem friendly topics and books creating video games there's just they they just seem they just look amazing I'm just really he's really excited to get playing with these and so am I it's going to be a fun year this year so these these are the kind of basic resources as I said um, 
we are just going to explore the year and see where it takes us. These are all the resources here and what I have is my folder with all of my main with the main curriculum in. I've got a grade one and a year three, grade three son and so this is the the Victor Australian, we're in the state of Victoria, where this is the Victorian curriculum, so I'll read through it and I might plan some other activities um, and just tick off that everything is covered, so make sure that they are learning everything they're supposed to be learning for a grade one and a grade three, and then some really, we just yep, are on our journey here. So that is my video of... Um, my third grade homeschool curriculum for 2017. If you've got any questions or any future videos you'd like me to film, leave them down in the comments. I look forward to reading them. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you subscribe. I am a stay at home, work from home, homeschooling mum, and this is my lifestyle channel where I share everything about our life, about minimalism, about making money online, and about homeschooling too. So make sure you subscribe and join the Yummy Inspirations community. And thanks again for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye.